it's so kind of like ridiculous that it almost flipped the odometer in my brain from this is ridiculous to like, this is actually a really clever way to use the file system <laughs> as a database. And the hemispheres are fighting it out the whole time. Well, I'll, I'll tell you about the inspiration for that. So, so for 12 folders is a Turing complete language. Is it? That's not all, not all the languages in here are, <laughs> but that one is. So the idea of folders is that it, 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 the inspiration for it was the SLang white space, where we use tab space and return as, as the only meaningful characters. And it decided, well, those are still characters. They're still a file. But what's, what's more empty than an empty looking file? And to me, that was really the empty folder or the folder that just has other folders in it because mm -hmm. it always just looks like trash, you know, like, like this is... So uh, the way that folders works, the names of the folders don't matter except for how they're read alphabetically. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the top level folders are commands and then the first folder alphabetically in each one, the number of folders in that tell you, tells you what kind of command it is. And then the second folder will be an expression that's passed to it depending on the type of command. So it's... it it it. it uh, this is this is usable. This is workable. Uh, one of the one of the things about folders is that I originally wrote it with a C sharp compiler, and this was probably around ten years ago. Uh, and it, so I, I originally made it sort of Windows only. Mm -hmm. this, this was sort of like the that that era of of, of C sharp. And the the funny thing about Windows is that it doesn't consider an empty folder content. So if you create a billion folders and, and you get info on it, it'll tell you that it takes up zero bytes on disk. 